check it out, guys. I've got merch. I've got hoodies, t-shirts, caps, and backpacks in so many colors and sizes. Go check it out now, guys. Link is in the description. Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Dragonfire here at the Lotus Nation. Reminder, Lotus Nation merch is now on sale. And it's actually on sale. So it's for sale and on sale. So go check out the little club merch link in the description if you want to cop some for 20% off. And let's get into today's video. So I have been working, working like a dog. And I actually managed to kill some more dragons and take some scales. So we've gotten, well, oh, uh, let me see. Yeah, we've got a, quite a bit here. Got, there you go. And we've got this many white ones as well. So I was thinking we probably can work on making an ice forge. So we've got the ice heart. We do need to get, we've got tons of dragon bones to make dragon bone blocks. Dragon bone, dragon bone blocks. And we also have scales to make the scale blocks. And I know we're going to need quite a bit. So quite a bit. So we're going to need one, two, three, four, five. Five dragon bricks on the top, so that's ten. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, seventeen dragon bricks, which is a lot. But we've already got started, but let me show you what I've been up to. I'm going to take this with me because we've got something to do. Um, I have set up a little area where the 3x3 three three is going to go. I don't know if it's big enough, actually. I might need to add some space. No, well, it should be fine. So this is where the Ice Forge is going to go, right here. So we're going to make use of the spacing as all the dragons are now down in the other section. I hate that it's raining. Am I going to do it? Yes, I am. I'm going to do it because I just don't want all these mobs. And the dodo is still there. What's up, dodo? Guys, I want you to leave a name suggestion for dodo. Or we should just call him dodo, actually. Because he's like our new little mascot in our nation. And this creeper does not want to be killed. So let's head down and show you guys what I've been up to. Of course, it has been some time. And I've spent some time on the server building, etc., etc. And our dragons have gotten a little bit bigger. Ooh. So this little guy, this little girl right here is a little... Oh, I forgot the name tags. It's a little bit bigger. But um, she's looking great. She's a little bit hungry. Here, you can take some food. Um, but she's so sweet and she's getting bigger by the moment. And she suits this area really well. So she is probably going to stay there. And we also are going to be naming them today. So stay tuned for some part of this episode. you got to watch it all to see if your comment is the one that will get shouted out for the names. Because they're pretty cute. Now... Let me show off this area first. I don't know whether I love it, okay? Because basically, it's an enchanted dragon, yeah? So, I kind of went for, like, a cauldron because that's magic and enchanted and, and then this green. And I think it's kind of cool. But if you guys think that it should be something else, let me know as well. Um, and we can change it up. For now, I think it's pretty cool. So, what we're going to do is move this little lady. Look how big Sunny is after getting. Sunny has after been growing. Hello, Sunny. And then we've got this little lady here. So that's why I brought the amulet. Because we're actually going to move her into her new home today. So that's going to be exciting. So basically what we're going to do today, obviously, is try and get the forge. I'm going to make everything that I have so far and see... Oh, look, she looks great in here. Actually, I think the green kind of makes it really pop. But let me know. Again, I can change it. It's not a big deal. And then we still have a section over there, and we can still obviously push back there. So we're going to try and get all of the dragon mount dragons as soon as we can so we can fill this whole area up. Try maybe get another skeleton one. Um, oh, I never checked if these guys actually had a baby. Let me have a little look in here. Is anything going on? Okay, let's move some of it out of the way. So I can have a little a little look. Little look-see. It doesn't look like there's a baby in here. But the last time I came back, there was just a dragon wandering around. Honestly, the moonlight egg just hatched all by itself. It doesn't look like there's a baby in here. So I think we are safe for now. But I reckon if we keep on breeding them, there'll be a chance of it happening. Guys, let me know in the comment section if you know exactly how they breed. Because obviously, that would be great. And Athena is getting too big. Like, literally too big. We're gonna have to push her back a little bit. She's outgrowing her little, um, her little area. She is so large. And a lot of you suggested that I build a platform so she can watch over all the dragons. And I really like that idea. So I definitely will be doing that in the coming days. And I'll do a shout out for one of the comments who suggested that. 
So like I said, we are going to be building the Dragon Forge today. We're going to see how it works. We'll be the first one to have an Ice Forge. And I think I think that's going to get us some favors. We're going to leave a sign and say, yeah, you can use the Forge if you want. But you got to leave some Dragon Meal or you got to leave something that will benefit the Lotus Nation. So let's get in here, grab our blocks. Let me just quickly check this. Nothing good in here. Okay, let's get rid of this. So... Uh, have we got any more scales in here? No, we moved everything. Oh, actually, while I was out hunting for ice dragons, I found Night Stalker scales and Terex scales. So for the Terex, we need the hat. Let's actually craft this. I wanted to show you guys because I think it's going to be... Oh, where does the hat go? There we go. And then the leggings for the Night Stalker. So we still have some extra scales left, which is pretty cool. Okay, let's put this on here. Oh, I don't know why they go sideways. It's a bit annoying. Okay, let's try this on so you guys can see it. Uh, I know you guys have probably seen it in another nation. Ah, oh, that's so cool. I have a mohawk. That is so cute. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I've got a mohawk. I look great. Okay, uh, this back on because obviously we need to have the best protection we can. Okay, it's going nighttime again. I hope the dragons are growing. They're a little bit far out for my liking for them to grow. I probably should have kept them closer while I'm doing all this. But let's try and make as many dragon scale blocks. I think that's what we got to do first, right? Dragon scale blocks. So, um, I don't know whether it'll work. Let's see. Just let's test this out real quick. If it will mix work with a mixture. <gasps> it won't. They have to be the same color. Oh, that puts our plan back a minute. Okay, so let me see. Um, it's just... Oh, there. There. Oh, goodness. I don't think we have enough. Okay, there. Okay, so let's see. There. Ooh. You know what? I could have just done it the other way. Uh, let's see. Two and two. <gasps> we don't have enough. Okay, so we only have seven. That's not, that's not good at all. Okay, but we've got a whole other pile. So let's do the scale blocks. I don't know whether they all have to be the same color, though. Because what color is this? Light blue? So I guess we can just do this. That's another seven, but I don't know. So how many did we say we needed? Like 14 or something? <laughs> 14. Okay, let's get the dragon bone blocks while we can and then we'll go and see if we have to hunt way more because I reckon we will. The bones are coming in handy for something, guys. We have been stocking them up for a long time and um, bone block, bone block, bone, bone block. That's not the right one. This is the right one. Okay, do this. Oh, 45 dragon bone blocks. Perfect. So if I'm right, it would go... Dragon bird. Okay, like the layer would go like this. It would go dragon bone block in each corner, and then one, two, three, and then scale. No, dragon bricks. We need to make these into bricks. That's right. Okay, so we need stone as well. So let me have a look and see if we have any stone. Ooh, we might need to go hunting for stone too. We need to cook some stone up, I think. Okay, we've got cobblestone. So let's cook that up because that becomes stone, right? Let me just double check this. I probably should have been a little bit more prepared. But look, it's one of those things that it's going to take ages to actually do. And I want to get working on it. So that's just stone. So I think that's right. Let me just see. Uh, dragon. What's it called? Dragon bricks. Dragon. Okay, so the ice ones are stone brick. Okay. So, not stone. Okay, okay. We need to get stone brick. How do you get stone brick? This is probably a stupid question, but let me see. Stone brick. It's just by cooking cracked stone brick will give us stone brick. Okay. So, basically, we got to go mining. We got to go get a whole... Why did I take the coal out? We got to go get a whole lot of more of scales, I think. Yeah, I think we need to get a lot of scales. A lot of scales. And then, uh, yeah, so we are going to go and we're going to try and hunt a dragon. I might do a lot of this off camera because we've hunted so many dragons. Uh, who have I got? I've got Penny. Okay. So I'm going to go to one of the known ice areas that I've found that I haven't... Now Penny has the armor on. I mean, I miss Leo so much, guys. And obviously, we figured out about the um, Beast Nation being so strong. And that's kind of crazy. But we need to make sure that, you know... We're ready, and that means having the best armor for ourselves and for the dragons. So that is what we're trying to do here. We want the ice dragons to have the ice armor and the fire dragons to have the fire steel armor because that is the best. And we haven't even finished the fire, but I think nobody else has the ice forge. So if we were one of the first to do that, that would be great because then everyone could use it. Uh, if they, you know, we need to have a little trade. Tiny Turtle gave me full access, but that's because he comes and takes whatever he wants from my nation. 
whenever he wants. Whatever he wants, whenever he wants. So that's a pretty safe deal. But he is gonna definitely gonna want to use this. And we definitely are gonna have to have some sort of... I don't know, like some sort of arrangement. So I think the last time I flew this direction... Let me just check. Yeah, we flew this direction. I think we found an ice area. So I'm just gonna fly for a while. We're gonna get there. Hopefully find a dragon. Get some scales. Kill a load of dragons. That's my goal. If it doesn't work here, I'm gonna go Twilight Forest. I'm not going to bring a dragon because we lost Leo in there and then Leo came out and Leo got killed. And I'm just not risking that again. So, um, yeah, we're just going to keep on flying. Like, look how far we got to go. It's a bit boring. So I'm going to leave you guys here. Oh, there we go. Okay, here's some of the ice area that we haven't really explored yet. So there should be... We might even find more ice eggs. Do you know that? Like, the glaciers that you guys told me about were pretty for ice eggs. So we're going to try and find an ice dragon nest. I wonder if there's like, you know what? There could be an actual nest around here. So I'm gonna jump down, have a little scan and see if we can find it because that would be great. The amount of mobs here though is insane. I kind of don't want to land until it's a little bit more daytime because if we got a nest, that would give us a big dragon. It would give us a lot of scales and it would give us enough to actually make some more bricks so we can make stone bricks, and then we gotta have to go mining, get cracked stone, cook it, all the rest of that stuff. There definitely is another way to get stone bricks. I'm trying to think of where I've seen it. Little temples and stuff like that. I could go just to the Gorgon Temple and take some. Probably be the quickest way, because there's a dead dragon here. Not uncommon in these areas. Oh, look, 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 look. More ice over here. Is there any nest? Come on. Give me a nest. Dead dragon. So like in the icy areas, it seems like they die just from starvation and in the desert too. So it's pretty interesting if you ask me. Like what's this little block all down, down here by itself? Look, there's another bigger dragon. No scales though. Kind of disappointing. I'm literally just waiting for it to turn daytime. Okay, so this is the icy area. I'm going to go and see. Oh, there's a nest right there. There's a nest. Have I been here before? I don't think I have. Have I? Okay, well, what we're going to do anyway, like I said, is try and find an actual ice cavern because that will be a bigger dragon. So let's hope we can find it. All right, guys, we got pretty lucky and it seems like there... Why does that turn to water? This is a silk touch. That's so annoying. This is silk touch, right? Yeah. Does it only work on certain things? Okay, let's try and head down this way and block off the water. We've got some torches as well. I don't know whether this is going to melt the ice though, but let's just dig down a little bit. Hopefully we don't hit ice again and there should be a dragon cave. I thought I heard one, but I could be wrong. Um, So let's keep on going. I don't know whether... No, it's not black when you come down here, is it? So let me just dig out here now. Oh, <gasps> there we go. Yes, there is one and there's a huge boy dragon down there so let's just shoot some arrows get it hurt a little bit keep on going like that oh baby taking loads of damage already this is good okay i should, probably should dig down a little bit but see it can't break blocks so it can't leave the cave anymore i wish it was a girl because we could have get an egg out of it but look we just need the scales that is the goal we need to get tons and tons and tons of different types of scales i don't want to waste all my arrows okay let's dig down a little bit oh goodness that is not what i wanted that is not what i wanted okay i'm gonna spawn point spawn point okay there we go it's trying to get out but it can oh creeper 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 oh no oh that's bad that's really bad now this creeper's gonna kill me oh no respawn okay whoa, whoa where am i okay we need to dig up the creeper blew a hole in the building Okay, now it's starting to fire some stuff up, which is not great. Okay, there we go. Quickly spawn point again. Woo, there we go. Okay, kill it. This is, seems like it might be a pretty easy one, though. Just need to keep on getting it. Getting it and boom. And it doesn't seem like there is a lot of creepers or anything down here, which is nice. Okay, now we need to get rid of some of this stuff so we have space for the scales. Okay, I think these are a different color scale again. I could be wrong. Is this a white dragon? Let me see. There we go. Okay, what color scales are we gonna get? Uh, oh, I don't know what to throw away. We don't need the flesh. Let's get rid of the stone. Ah, we have a heart. Okay, so let's go. Oh, come on. Come on. Pick up the scales. Pick up the scales. These look like... Why am I picking them up? Oh, I am. 58 dragon scales perfect that is a really good amount let's have a little look see around i mean we could try get some of the silver for the other dragons 
Let's have a little look in the chest, see if there's anything we're taking. Uh, flame. There's gold. There's bones. Take some bones. Ah, skeleton! You are not going to kill me after I defeated that dragon. No way, Jose. Okay, let's have a look. <gasps> so many bones. Perfect. We do need dragon meal. We've got some young dragons that we need to level up that we might do today as well. That one's clear. Um... Any other chests? Any other chests? Doesn't look like there's a lot in here. It's a very small nest, considering. Obsidian. Uh, knockback and sharpness. No, we'll leave all the rest of this stuff. Okay, guys. So I'm going to go hunting for a lot more dragons. And hopefully we'll be able to get enough scales that we can build this forge. Okay, guys. So, <clears throat> excuse me. We have had some luck. We managed to get, I think, enough to do this. I think. And we also managed to get an egg from killing one of the dragons, which is awesome. So, we got the stone bricks as well. I actually just went to one of the temples and took one instead of trying to get them ourselves. So, basically, what we're going to do is, I think it goes like this. Let me see. This should be one. There you go. Four ice bricks. Nice. Okay. And I think if I equate it enough, it's like 85 or 80 something we need. So I'm going to see if it works with different colors as well. So what we're going to need to do is get some bricks in the positions. Oh, it's not there. It's here like that. Obviously, uh, we want to get this right obviously okay there and there okay uh let's see if this works with different color scales because i am worried it won't oh it does awesome okay cool so let's uh stock these up let's uh split them go there split them and put them in there okay let's see what we can get out of that split this put these here uh split these boom there's another set and split them that's another set and i think we're just about done but i don't know whether we're gonna have enough hopefully okay i don't know whether we had enough brick now that i think about it ah that's so annoying okay i gotta go back to the temple the gorgon's temple and go get some stone brick and then we'll come back and finish this off okay so we have 56 Oh, I forgot we still have all these silver scales as well that we can make into, like, more scale blocks. So, let's actually just do this quicker, I think. This probably would be the best idea. So, there's the silver one. Let's do this. So, we got another six. And now we need the ice block. Ooh, okay, so the ice scale block. What's it called? There we go. There we go. And do this. And do it again. Boom. And I think that's all we can do, is it? No, we can do more. Okay. <gasps> I think we're getting close. Oh, no, we're missing two scales. Okay, have we got enough? We may have enough. We may not have enough. I think we have enough. All right. So there's that. We've got the bone blocks here. And now we got to make the forge. Although, yeah, we're probably going to need a little bit more scales. So I might go and see if I can borrow some off someone. But let's get the initial part built, the layer one. And then there's three layers to this, as you've seen in other people's episodes so we've got to do a uh, dragon bone block so wait one two one two three or one two three okay let's go so it goes dragon bone block dragon bone block in the uh, dragon bone block dragon bone block then dragon bricks in the middle so these are these ones dragon ice bricks like oh not like that Ooh, come on I was like, don't disappear on me. There and there. Okay. And then the next layer is dragon bricks all around apart from in the front too. Like this. That's right. And then the top layer is the same again. Bone block. Bone block. Boom. Perfect. Now all we got to do is make the middle parts. And that is done by using the bone bricks, which we have enough. I actually think we have enough of everything. I think more than enough. I think I totally overestimated it we need some iron ingots and we need is that silver ingots or iron ingots i'm not sure let me see this and uh, like this boom okay so that is our aperture and then the core we need the heart for it's actually a very complicated process you guys but once it's done it will be 
Awesome. And then the rest of it is around and then the heart. And we've got tons left over. Boom. Oh my goodness. I'm very excited about this. Okay, so the input, the dragon core goes in the middle and then the import block in front. So let me see. So dragon core is aperture ice core. Okay, so it's this. Oh, and it's lighting lit up. And then, yeah. Okay, I think that's it. Yes, we've got the grills on all the sides. <gasps> this is so cool. Okay, now we need to go get our iron ingots and the blood that we have, the ice blood. We don't have a lot because we've been going for scales. Too many scales, apparently. But we actually have enough that we could probably give to someone else to make it. Uh, we've only got six. and uh, We've got iron ingots there. And we need to go get one of our ice dragons that is old enough. So let's grab Penny real quick so we can get there Whoop. real fast. And go and grab one of our dragons. This is so exciting, you guys. Okay, Benny, you're going to land beside Athena here because we are going to get her her own little platform soon. So you'll have this all to yourself because Leo has gone too. All right, there we go. Let's go get one of the ice dragons. They have to be stage three or above, I think. So I'm going to go with either Jon Snow or Crystal, obviously. So let's go with Crystal. Come on, Crystal. We can actually fly you there. Why not? Let's go. Look at these baby dragons. We need to make some dragon meal. I can't believe we finally have an ice forge. This is so cool. All right. There we go. All right. If we leave her here, I think. I think if they're on a chain, it works. But let's try to do this anyway. So we've got the iron ingots and we've got the blood. And boom, it's working. Oh my goodness. That is so cool. We obviously just have to let her go until it's done. But... Let me see if I can get in without getting hit. Look, it's nearly... Oh, she's going to have to work hard. Look at that go. That is so cool. The animation is so cool. We are going to be the first to have ice steel. That is very, very exciting. Now, we're only going to get six pieces. We could make a sword out of it. Or we could just... Look, we should have a piece now. Oh, it's nearly there. <gasps> we also have an egg we can hatch. Another ice dragon. Woohoo. This is so exciting. There we go. Our first piece. Ice dragon steel ingot. So obviously it costs a lot. Let me just see. Ice steel. So for... We can get the armor, actually. We should probably do the armor first and then go to this. Because these are blocks. And they'll take an awful long time. So with six, one, two, three, four, five, we can make the helmet if we wanted to. If once this is done, it's going to take a while though. So let's wait till it's done and then we'll make the helmet. Okay, Crystal did the best job. She'll go back in the horn for now. We've got six ingots. What, what? I mean, it's so much work for something so little. But now that we have a build, we can strictly go for blood and now we have the ice dragon helmet i'm actually gonna put it look oh that looks so good it kind of looks like the white one but not really it looks obviously a lot better so guys i will be hunting for some ice blood in my spare time i might go see if i can trade tiny turtle for his ice blood for these ice bricks in the next episode and then that way i'll get more and they'll be great and we still have a lot here that like i'm thinking i could probably do a fire one i could definitely make a fire one so i'll probably do that off cam and then in the next episode i'll have an ice and a fire one next to each other so we can always build our own steel and everything so we can definitely get the armor a lot quicker we won't have to go to anyone else's nation but of course we want to see if tt will do that trade for the ice blood and let's see if who has any i mean it's open to anyone i'll give them the scale blocks the ice scale blocks if they give me some ice blood but guys that's all for today i hope you enjoyed this episode of building the ice forge i know it took a while but you know what these things are intricate and they're worth it in the long run don't forget to check out the little club merch the link is down below 20 percent off if you want to cup your lotus nation merch and support the series make sure to head on over there but until next time guys bye aha i nearly forgot and you guys nearly forgot too oh my goodness bonus time bonus meme as beauty pie would say okay guys we are going to name the dragon so where is the comment i want to make sure i get the name right 
And the shout out goes to Robin Battams. It says, call your pink dragon Harmony and your ice dragon Bliss. And I just thought that was really, really cute. So we're going to go with those both names from the one person. So congratulations. We're going to head on down. Head on down. Head on down. We could actually use Crystal to get down there because she needs to go back in her pen anyway. So she can still age up. I don't want to accidentally name her. So let's get that. Oh my goodness. What a day it has been. I nearly forgot to name the dragons but you guys would have killed me in the comments so it's good to be heading back in yeah we definitely need to take the babies up into the cave until they're grown okay there we go now so you are not harmony you are going to be bliss let's name you bliss and now we'll head on over to Harmony. I love it. A lot of you guys were saying to call it Kelly because, you know, the pink, the lotus. Some people were saying to call it lotus. But, you know, there might be a lotus dragon coming soon. Who said that? Not me. Not me. I didn't say it. <laughs> anyway, let's go and name this dragon and then that will be I mean, you guys know what's about to happen. We're gonna name her Harmony. Well, I think this is really cool We'll definitely try and get some boys around here get more eggs We obviously want to get the rest of the types of the dragon mounts dragon. So the air one uh, The zombie one the, There's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. We have the moonlights. But anyway guys now I'm gonna leave it there. You know all the rest. Bye